it's me, the ukulele teacher, here to teach you how to play Yesterday by Paul McCartney of a very famous band that is called Beatles. So, grab your uke. Make sure it's in tune, and when it is in tune, it should sound like this. And let's get ready to play Yesterday. One, two, three, four. Yesterday These are the chords you're going to leave for the song. If you already know them, then skip ahead now. But before you do that, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more lessons like this one, and make sure you subscribe and turn on the notifications so you never miss a lesson. To play the chord of F, put your first finger on the first fret of the second string, and your second finger on the second fret of the fourth string. And the chord of F should sound like this. To play the chord of E minor 7, put your first finger on the second fret of the third string, and your second finger on the second fret of the first string. And the chord of E minor 7 should sound like this. To play the chord of D minor, go back to that F shape, but add your third finger to the second fret of the third string. And the chord of D minor should sound like this. To play the chord of C, put your third finger on the third fret of the first string. And the chord of C should sound like this. To play the chord of B flat, bar the first and second strings on the first fret with your first finger. Then add your second finger to the second fret of the third string, and your third finger to the third fret of the fourth string. And the chord of B flat should sound like this. To play the chord of G7, put your first finger on the first fret of the second string, your second finger on the second fret of the third string, and your third finger on the second fret of the first string and the chord of G7 should sound like this. To play the chord of A, put your first finger on the first fret of the third string, and your second finger on the second fret of the fourth string, and the chord of A should sound like this. And to play the chord of A7, just lift up your second finger, and the chord of A7 should sound like this. To play the chord of G minor 6, take that F shape, but this time move everything down one string, so your second finger is on the second fret of the third string, and your first finger is on the first fret of the first string, and the chord of G minor 6 should sound like this. And to play the chord of C7, just leave your first finger on the first fret of the first string, and the chord of C7 should sound like this. Now the strumming pattern that I play most of the way through this song is a nice and gentle down, 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 up, like this. Down, down. Most of the way through the song, I either play it twice on each chord or once on each chord, but there are some exceptions, so I'm going to take you through the song now, line by line. But let's start off by playing it through four times on the chord of F as an intro. One, two, three, four. So for the first line of verse one, we play that pattern twice on F, once on E minor seven, once on A7, and once on D minor, like this. One, two, one, one, one. Then we play one downstroke on D minor, and one downstroke on C, 
and then we start to play the pattern on B flat for the next line. So the first line should sound like this. Down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up. Then for the next line the chords are C to F. Down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down. And then for the final line of the verse the chords are D minor to G7 to B flat to F. And here we play that down, 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 up pattern once on each of those chords, like this. Down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up. So let's put that all together and play through the verse, nice and slow, as an instrumental. One, two, three, four, one. So let's put that all together now and sing through verse one. Yesterday. Verse 2 is exactly the same, so let's carry on and play what we've just learned, but this time singing verse 2. Suddenly So there you have it, the verses are all the same, and let's be honest, they're pretty straightforward. But now we move on to the chorus, and a quick word of warning, the chord changes come thick and fast. The good news is we're playing the song pretty slowly, so hopefully we should be able to keep up. The first line of the chorus, the chords are A to A7, to D minor, to C to B flat, to D minor, to G minor 6, to C7, to F. That's a lot of chords to remember, so don't try and take it all in at once. But what you do need to know, is that you play the down, 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 up pattern once on the A and A7. Then we just play one down stroke on the D minor, C, B flat, and D minor chords. And then we carry on playing the down, 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 up pattern once on the G minor 6, C7, and F. Like this. One, one. And in the second line of the chorus, the chords are exactly the same. So let's put that all together and play through the chorus. Why she had to go, I don't know, she wouldn't say. I said something wrong, now I long for yesterday. Then the rest of the song is nearly the same as what we've already learned. We play verse 3, which is the same as the other two verses, and then we repeat the chorus. So let's go ahead and do that. Yesterday Love was such an easy game to play Now I need a place to hide away Oh, I believe in yesterday And then we finish with verse 4, which is almost exactly the same as verses 3, except we repeat the last line. So let's go ahead and play through verse 4 together. 
yesterday. Love was such an easy game to play. Now I need a place to hide away. Oh, I believe in yesterday. Do, 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 do. Put that all together, and that's how to play Yesterday by The Beatles. I've been the ukulele teacher. If you have any requests for future lessons, then let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, until next time, I love you all and I wish you the best.